Back to first to find a balance in first position. Here we go. Five, six, seven, open, and plie tendu front, close first, plie tendu side, close first, tendu to the back, close first, four starch rise, and open. Grand plie, two, come up on three, double demi, nice, cord bras forward. Coming up, tendu side, plie in second, take your time, tendu, plie, tendu, plie, four starch, rise up and open, grand plie, Two, come up, double demi, into the bar. And tendu round to fourth position. Demi, and stretch. Demi, open, grand plie. Tendu to fifth, and same thing. Quarter bra forward. Coming up. Nice, come right back. Balance in first position. Lift up your lower abdominals. Ribs forward. Neck relaxed. Find your finish. Good, try to fill up the time a little bit more in the ton liés. Uh, take like more of a U-shaped trajectory rather than just finding your diagonal line in the plie. Try to start the plie here. So with your hips, not necessarily your feet. Other side. Five, six, seven, and Plie tendu, close. 
Turn to side. Close to the back and close. Four star tries and lower. Grand plie and come up. Double demi. Port bras forward and up. Now take all your time here. Tendu. Plie and tendu. Plie. Tendu. Plie. Four star tries up. And lower. Grand plie. Demi. And open. Oh, sorry. Double demi into the bar. And tendu. Round to fourth position. Two demis and a grand. Pick up the front of your pelvis. Tendu to fifth. forward and back. Tondi back to first balance. Put breath under your armpits, activate your lats, and find your finish. Just be careful of any leaning forward in grand plie. It tends to let go of your, your turnout and your inner thighs. Um, so just make sure that it's the same amount of pressure and resistance the whole way down and the whole way up, and you're keeping the same, like, uh, the same uprightness in your pelvis the whole time. Um, Tandi from first position. Seven, eight, we're gonna go plie tendu again. So plie and close, two. Circle, circle, close. Circle, circle, close. So those are just toe circles, they're on the oar. Plie, close first, two, side. And circle, circle, close. Circle, circle, close. Plie back, close first, two, to the back. Circle, circle, close, still on the oar. Close first, relve bounce. Two, three, four, close to susu, sutanu. Open lower straight legs. Plie. Two, and circle, circle, close, circle, circle, close. Same thing side, same thing back, then rally bounce. Two, three, four, sutanu. Opened lower straight legs. Cool. Here you go. Five, six, seven, and plie tendu front, close first. One, two, and circle, circle, close. Circle, circle, close. Side, and one, two, and circle, circle, close. Circle, circle, close to the back. Close, and in, in, and circle, circle, close. Circle, circle, close, relve balance. Sutanu, open, lower straight legs. Oh, plie, close, two, and circle, circle, close, circle, circle, close to the side, and two, circle, circle, close, circle, circle, close, back, and one, two, and circle, circle, close, Relve balance. Sutanu. Open lower straight legs. There. Oh! Yeah, watch out for that detail of the lowering straight legs. Um, ben, just because I can see you at this angle, but it might be for others as well, make sure that when you're going to the side that you're fully shifted over your standing leg. You're a little bit out here. Yeah, which is going to not help your pirouettes later. So just fully put that pelvis over your uh, ball of your standing foot. Um, your pelvis is an arrow, it points down, but it has to point down over top of whatever you need it, like, to stand on, so make sure that it's just stacked. Um, and 
again, check your own pelvis and see if you're doing that too. Um, from fifth, seven, eight, we go two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, we go two, one, two, we tomlie forward, tomlie with round de jambe. Two back, two, tomlie back, tomlie with round de jambe. And side, two, double releve, close back. Uh, hold on, I just forgot what it is. Oh, then you do that again, double releve. Then we go, uh, tendu front, cloche back, close fifth. So, one, two, and three, four. And one, two, three, four. And one, two, double releve, close back, double releve, close front. Front, back, fifth. One, two, tommy, tommy, round. One, two, tommy, tommy, round. And one, two, double, rail, they close front, double, rail, they close back, back, front, close fifth. Then just solo could be a balance wrapped, susu, and finish. I'm not super concerned about what like specific arm position you're making during the tommy's. I would prefer that you allow your arm to naturally react to whatever movement is happening in a way that like feels comfortable on your body for today. <laughs> cool. Five, six, seven, eight to the front. Fifth, fifth, and tommie, tommie, round. Fifth, fifth, and tommie, tommie, round, and close. Fifth. Fifth and heel, heel, close back. Heel, heel, close front. Front, back, close fifth. And in, in, tommie, tommie, round. Fifth, fifth, tommie, tommie, round. And fifth, fifth, double heel. Close, double heel, no hula. Back, front, close, sir, le coup de pied balance. Check your hips here, so see if your arrow is pointing over the ball of your foot. Pick up your standing hip as high as you can. Chin lifted. And susu to finish. Good, I saw some nice timing there. Watch out when we do double releve. The, the action of that is you trying to make your leg like as long as possible from your hip socket. So it's almost like if somebody was like holding your hip up and then you were able to put your heel down, like that would be hashtag goals, like go for your longest leg possible, but try not to do that with like this like shift in your hips, okay? Other side. Five, six, seven, eight, and fifth, fifth, tommie, tommie round. Fifth, fifth, tommie, tommie, round. And fifth, fifth, and double heel. Better, double heel. Open your arm a little wider, Emma. And to the back. Back, tommie, tommie, round. In, in, tommie, tommie, round. And fifth. Nice timing, Deborah. Double heel, close, double heel. Stretch your fingers, Hannah. Back, front, close. Sur le coup de pied. And find your finish. Good. Make sure that you're completing the line of your arms with your like pinky finger because that helps activate these muscles in your forearm, which you kind of need. Um, okay. Degage, we're going to go one, two, three. One, two, close, close back. One, two, three. One, two, close, close front. Then we go three side, two, three. One, two, three. Then we go two on quad, two front, but then we're gonna go side closing front, side closing back, two back. Then we start to the back. One, two, three. One, two, cloche, close front. One, two, three. One, two, cloche. One, two, three. One, two, three. Two back, two side, two front, 
or two side closing front, two front. Then we're going to balance in a degage front, um, lower to four and comrade back. So we go balance degage front for eight, releve fourth comrade back, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, balance inside leg degage back, and then susu and finish. Okay, our arms will just be in uh, second position for all the degages, except when you go with the, uh, the strange on So we just did one, two, three, one, two, close, one, two, three, one, two, close, side, two, three, side, two, three. Then when we go on quad, let's go arm down, focusing on your hips before we go to the back. Okay? Again, that balance is degage front, fourth position, combre back with your arm in arabesque, inside leg, degage, and then susu finish. Got it? All right, cool. Six, seven, eight. One, two, three. One, two, close. One, two, three. One, two, close. Close fifth. Side, two, three. Side, two, three. Two front, two side closing front, side closing back, two back. Back, two, three. One, two, and close. One, two, three. One, two, and close. Side, two, three. Side, two, three. Two back, side closing back. Side closing front, two front. Degage front balance. Chin lifted heel. Lats active, fourth position, comrade right back. And pick up your inside leg to degage derriere. Stretch that, uh, that back leg all the way, Debra. Rotate your heel towards the ground, everybody. Stretch through your pinky toe, ribs forward. And Susu, find your finish. Good, make sure your legs are really fully active to the back especially. Um, try to point through your pinky toe because it helps activate your outside hamstring um, and that'll create like a longer line. Okay, other side. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. One, two, close. And one, two, three. One, two, close to the side. Two, three, side, two, three, two front. Side closing front, side closing back, two back. Back, two, three, one, two, close. Front, two, three, one, two, close. Side, two, three, side, two, three, two back. Side, side, front. And dig a front balance. And fourth position, come right back. Inside leg. Now stretch through that, ha uh, that pinky toe, hamstring. Open your uh, arm a little bit more, uh, Natalie. Susu, and finish. Um, I think a couple of us could, in our, uh, what, whatever you call it, third or fifth, um, we could rotate our shoulders down and uh, together a little bit more, especially when we are lifting our leg in the back. Um, I didn't feel like we all had our, our shoulder blades as actively engaged as we could have in our degage. And if, if that's happening in degage, like we gotta get it ready for when our leg goes up higher, right? Okay, round de jambe. So we're gonna start in fifth position, seven, eight. And PK forward to right here, right derriere. Close fifth, balance to the right. Su su. Then we're gonna go round de jambe and plie. Uh, one jete passe. Then we go forward with our arm. One, two, just first four breath. Three, four. We uh, brush to the front. Right tire, right. double pay side, close back. Then we go plie, tendu back. Pique, plie, balance, pique de susu, close back, one and plie, one jete passe. Four with your arm, we can take the top half of our quarter bra, three, four, ma, passe, développe, close front. Okay, that part one more time. So seven, eight, and one, two, 
three and uh, four, five, six, seven, eight, and a uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Then we do the same thing back, back, uh, pique, balance, susu, one in plie, one jete passe, four with your arm, and then bat ma back, passe, développe to the side. After that, we're gonna go plie front, carry side, double round, pique close, plie back, carry side, double round, pique close. Then we uh, do a little, um, and that's, that's like, that can be at 60 degrees, it doesn't have to be 90 unless you want it to be. Then we're going to go tombe coupe, fondue, fondue back, attitude balance, five, six, seven, eight. Then we're gonna go panche, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, wait, that's not actually what I wrote down. After you go panche, oh, you close fifth position, plie, and you tandu side. You go into the bar and forward, into the bar and back, and then find your finish. So part A is uh, pique, close fifth, balance away, susu, plie, jete passe. Forward with your arm, brush front, passe, double pay side. Reverse all of that. Then we go plie front, carry side, double run, pique close. Back, carry side, double run, pique close. Tombe, coupe, coupe, attitude, quasi. questions about all of that? No? Okay, cool. Yeah, I know round, my round of jobs tend to be a little long, but I hope, hopefully explained it clear enough. Here you go. Five, six, seven, and plie tendu du front, pique, close, fifth, and balance, pique de su, su. Round and plie, and stretch. Plie, brush front, passe, and forward with your arm. Two, stretch your knees through first position. Pull up your standing hip, Hannah. Bama front, passe, développe, tendu, close back, and pique, close fifth, and balance, pique de susu, plie, Jete passe, and four with your arm. Lift to the back, passe, double side, heel forward, close front, plie front, carry side, double round, down up, close, plie back, carry side, double round, down up, close. Tombe coupe and switch and switch attitude quasi balance five six lift your back knee and panche come on up close fifth position plie tandu side and into the bar and forward into the bar, and back and around. Good, find your finish. Um, so that was really lovely, um, really nice port round, lots of good plies and round de jam accenting is very nice. Um, when we go for our devil pay to the side, if we could show our heel a little bit more forward, that would be really nice. Um, I feel like there wasn't enough like intention for that to happen and there could have been a little bit more intention for that heel to come forward while your knee presses back. Um, and then when we are going, doing our jeté passe from the back to the front, make sure that you're, you're really treating that with integrity as well, that like pressing of your knee back while your heel comes forward. All about knee forward or knee back, heel forward. So let's try it a little bit more on the other side. Here you go.
And balance it. Susu. Plie. And jete cross it. Four with your arm. Lift to the front. Passe. Now here it is. Heel forward. Good. Close back. Pique derrière. Close fifth. And balance. Pique de susu. Plie back. And around. Jete passe. Nice four. Keep your eyes aware of what's happening, reacting to what's going on. And plie front, carry side, double round, down, up, and close. Nice timing bend, plie back, and side, double round, down, up, close, and tombe coupe, and front, and back, attitude. Push your rib cage forward, right side of your waist forward. And ponche. Coming up. And plie. Tondu to the side. Into the bar. And forward. In and back. Good. But yeah, it's always nice to have your, your eyes like engaged with whatever's happening. It tells a much better story than if you're just like staring in front of you, which you weren't staring in front of you, but I think that we all could, could continue to grow awareness like with our eyes. Um, then when we go into panche, like the tendency is for your weight to immediately get placed in the back of your hamstring on your standing leg. So like if I was balancing here and I had my balance, like, well, that's not really my balance. Hold on. If I had my balance here and then I went into this ponche, most of us would go here. And I'm wondering if we could stay shifted up and forward, right? Because this, this uh, placement is going to be better here than what we want to do here because this feels like a nice stretch. But I encourage you to try to keep that hamstring up and forward when we go into our ponche instead. Just go take a second with that and see if... See if it's helpful to you. Yeah, even a little bit more, Emma, still just went back a little bit. That's nice, ladies. Yeah, good. All right. So we're going to do fondue and frappe together. So fifth position, we'll do it uh, on rel, uh, we'll do it twice. We'll do it on flat and then on rel there. Seven, eight, no, not fifth. We go start with it. Fondue to the front. One, two, three, four, five. Fondue to the side. One, two, three, four, five. Fondue to the back. One, two, three, four, five. Petite mama with your inside leg. It goes up and then down and closes front. So it goes five, six, seven, eight. Fondue. This is on rela bay. One, two, three, four, five. Fondue to the side. One, two, three, four, five. Fondue to the front. One, two, three, four, five. Petit bama up your leg and down your leg. Then we're going to take a J. Oh, we attitude front balance, and then we're going to, so after we just did Petit Mama, we close Susu. Let's go fondue, attitude front, find your balance, five, six, seven, eight. Then we'll go one, two, three, four. Foot it to your other side, Susu, and finish. So fondue to the front, one, two, three, four, five. Fondue to the side, one, two, three, four, five. Fondue to the back, one, two, three, four. Four, five, inside leg, up your knee to retire, down your leg. Then we start back on releve. 
After we go back on releve and do our petit bama, we fondue, attitude front balance for eight, plie uh, at 90 degrees, fouette to the other side to find that placement. So now we're gonna need to shift our hamstring forward on our other side and then see soon finish. Okay? Cool. Five, six, seven, and fondue to the front. One, two, three, four, five, fondue to the side. One, two, three, four, five, fondue to the back. One, two, three, four, five, inside leg, petit bama. Good, and back down your leg. Fondue to releve. One, two, three, four, five, fondue to the side. One, two, three, four, five, fondue to the front. One, two, three, four, five, inside leg, petit bama. And back down your leg. Fondue, attitude, find your balance. Good, we have a little more time. You can keep balancing. And plie, stretch your leg, flat tight, shift that way, and find your finish. Good. Um, make sure that your body is, so make sure you shift your body enough forward during your frappes to the back that your body doesn't have to do this like little like jerk thing. I know I probably do it myself sometimes still. So just think, be a little bit more aware about the fact that every time you frappe, like even though it's quick, you still have to put your ribs forward because your leg's going back, right? It's a little bit because it's low, but you still have to move your ribs forward. Okay, left side. There was a nice petite mama was happening. Five, six, seven, and fondue. To the front. One, two, three, four, five, fondue. To the side. One, two, three, four, five, fondue. To the back. One, two, three, four, five, inside leg. Nice. And fondue. One, two, three, four, five, fondue. One, two, three, four, five, fondue. Inside leg. Fondue. Attitude front. Point the very ends of your toes. Lift your chin. And elongate or plie. Fouette. And find your finish. Mm, a couple of us are doing our our fifth really far forward, and it's causing our shoulders and uh, chest to go forward as well, and that was affecting our balance. Um, so just take a second and see if you did that. All right, let's do a little stretch together. Before up. Seven and eight. Come up to right to right. One and two. Attitude, grab your inside your heel. Four, come right back. Six, come up. Seven, eight, let go. Carry to the side. Carry to the back. Tondu, close fifth. Then we're going to just go brush side, turn in, and out, turn in, turn out, turn in, turn out. Lower, and then you can pull away from your bar. You can stretch your calf for eight counts, five, six, other side. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, 
six. Each one can get a little higher if you like, and then whatever you want towards the bar for eight counts and finish. Um, think about where your hips are, what, what your hips are over top of the whole time we're doing this, okay? It's really going to help with extensions. Here you go. Seven, eight, up to right to right, and plie, calm right back, take your time, and find your center, let go, two counts, front, carry side, nice, carry to the back, good Natalie, and close, and brush side. Turn in, keep it gooey. Turn out. Turn in. Turn out. Turn in. Turn out. And whatever you want. And find the other side. That's your end. Plie. Grab your heel. Shoulders down. Find your center. Two pounds front. Stretch through your leg. Good. Carry side. Carry back. Tondu. Close. And brush side. Turn in. And brush side. And turn in. And open side. Last one. Good, go ahead and stretch. I'll play this music from the beginning. So you have like a couple minutes to stretch. But if you can see me, you can keep stretching. We're gonna do uh, Baba with cloche. Seven, eight, we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, front, two, three, one side. Then we start to the back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, three, two, three, one side. Then plie, you can take a pirouette, find your balance, and then susu and finish. So just eight swings, four, five, six, seven, eight, shifting our ribs forward as we go back. Um, three bat ma, front, one side, swing back, eight, three to the back, one side. Then pirouette and find your balance in rat tire. Okay? Sweet, here we go. 
five, six, seven, eight. Front, back, front, back, front, back, seven, eight. To the front. Two, three, one side, and swing. Ma. Two. Stretch your arm all the way, Emma. And side. Pirouette. Find your balance. Good. Lift your inside hip, Hannah. Nice rotation, Emma. Good. That's good with your hips, Ben. And find your finish. Deborah, I love your cat interfering with bar. My cat, uh, she likes to jump in while I'm doing abs and just lay on my stomach. They, they don't, they, they just do what they want. Other side, everybody, here you go. Five, six, seven, and eight. Three front. One side. One side and pirouette. Good. And find your finish. Good. We're gonna come to the center. So if you need to adjust your uh, your space, you can do that right now. Do um, from the position in quasi. Um, oh, wait, I can do the other side, so it looks like I'm doing the same as you. <laughs> Even though you, I'm sure you can, you can tell what leg I'm on because it's bad leg. So we go to the front. Then we're gonna go through first. Our other leg goes to front, to back. Then we're gonna switch to third arabesque to back. Then we plie round jambe front and around to fourth. Uh, pirouette, single in sur le coup de pied derrière, land in tendu back, brush front, back, uh, sorry, brush front, back, plie, close fit. Then we go to front, one and two, other leg, four to the back, third arabesque, plie right, and pirouette, tendu, front, back, plie, and stretch. Then we're gonna go to the side, one, two, heel, and close. One, two, heel, close. Su, su, plie, pirouette from fifth, pirouette from fifth, pirouette, closing back. One, two, heel, and close. One, two, heel, close. Su, su, plie, pirouette, pirouette, and up, close back. Okay, let's mark. Seven, so just marking, and one, two, one, two, to the back, third row, backs, plie, front, here, left, lands in tendu, push, push, plie, okay? Then the second part is one, two, heel, Close and one, two, heel, close and we see soup. Plie, pirouette, land in fifth, pirouette. Um, if you want to add anything to that pirouette, you maybe would 
uh, the pirouette sequence at the end, you could uh, keep your leg up. So instead of doing three times going to fifth, you could do a fondue instead. So you could go pirouette, pirouette, fondue up if you so choose. That's definitely a more difficult version. Or you could go like single, double, single, or you could go single, single, double, single, double, triple, um, triple from fifth. Ooh, good luck with that one if you do that one. <laughs> okay. All right, here we go. Five, six, seven, and fifth, and fifth, other leg, to the back, third arabesque, round de jambe, to fourth, pirouette, lands in tandem, cloche, cloche, plie and stretch, to front, other leg, to back, third arabesque, Rond de jambe, fourth, pirouette, and push, plie to the side, and fifth, fifth, and heel, and other leg, fifth, and heel, and pique de susu, plie, pirouette, up, and third one closes back to the side, other leg, two, and heel. And one, two, and here. Lift your elbows, Kelly. Pique, plie, pirouette, up, and up. Oh wait, is it is it Callie or Kaylee? It's Kaylee. Okay, Kaylee. I was like, did I say that right? Yeah, just a little bit more lift in here. You're getting a little bit. Press your shoulders down, lift your elbows. It's that tension between like the two things happening that makes it strong. If you're not doing one or the other, it's gonna make it like a little, little uh, less strong. Emma, you tend to bend too much in your elbow. So I just work on showing the audience your palm. This sends a lot of energy forward if you, uh, if you present your palms to the audience. Um, most of us did, instead of doing Ronde Jean de Breath, most of us did a pot of os which like is not a bad thing, it's just not what I did. So what I did do was rond de jambe so that we can find this like liftedness on our standing leg before lowering to fourth um, because the pas de basque would just leave a little bit less time for that. Um, it was pretty good overall. Um, I think that we could be a little bit more intentional, intentional about how we are using our heads when we're doing um, the tondus at the beginning, right? So like you have to, yes, you can react to your body, but you also don't wanna look like you're um, choosing like a lot of different things at the same time. So just like know if you're gonna go here, if you're gonna go here, right? There's a lot of options in ballet and I don't wanna tell you like one is right because they're all right, but you need to know, um, that sometimes they clash with each other, right? So sometimes the different options, they don't mix when they're together. So maybe just pick um, what you're going to do and stick to it. <laughs> um, let's go again. And then when we go to the side, we're gonna go one, two, three, four, heel, and close. One, two, three, four, heel, close, okay? The timing will not uh, change, so the, those tandus are gonna be a little bit quicker, okay? Cool. Yeah, it looks like we needed to do it again to get a little bit more on our legs. So make sure we're feeling that lift in the fronts of our hips before the pirouette. And one, two, other leg. Good. To the back. And round the jambe. And fourth. Pirouette, lands and tandem. Close. Check your head. Plie. And one. Try to vary your dynamics. Decide when you're gonna be on time, when you're gonna make the audience wait. Round the jump. Up. Push, push, plie. Four tendus. One, two, three, four, heel. And one, two, three, four, heel. Su, su, plie, pirouette. Ribs forward bend, and one, two, three, four, heel, and one, two, inner thighs, heel, susu, and 
Tap here up. Good. Okay, that was better. I felt like we got a little bit more on our leg that time. Um, short uh, adagio, not too crazy. So we're gonna go from fifth position, seven, eight. It starts with ballo take double K. So we go right to your right, plie to the front, right to your right, plie to the back, promenade five, six, seven, eight. Then we're gonna go fondue, double K to a face or a carte derriere, balance to the left, balance to the right. This is my left, balance, soutenu. Plie, then we're going to do a little développé that closes back. Retire, balote. So lean back with your body in balote. Retire, to the front. Promenade, six, seven, eight. And développé, two, balance, balance, soutenu, plie, développé, close back. Okay, so retire, balote, three, four, promenade is five, six, seven, eight, fondue, one, extend, two, balance, three, four, soutenu, on five, plie, and fifth, six, double pay, seven. From this double pay, try to assemble a fifth. So instead of coming to susu, try to close everything at the same time to the plie, okay? It'll just require that you're like up on your standing leg a little bit more. Um, this is your tempo. So it'll be one, two, three, four, promenade five, six, seven, eight. Fun do devil pen and balance it, balance it, suit a new plie, devil pen, close back. Okay, so there is a little bit like of time, like it's not super fast, it's maybe on the slow side, but with that, I want you to find a little bit more dynamic uh, cho choices in how you're moving. Like I'm seeing those sometimes, but I think that we could be a little bit more confident, a little bit more definitive about what parts you want to lengthen, what parts you want to like make quicker, right? Um, and make that a personal choice, you know, whatever is feeling right in your body. It doesn't have to be whatever you think is going to look cool. Okay, here we go. Find what feels good. Seven, eight, right here, right? Plie front, use your head, arabesque, promenade. Waist forward on your right side, Natalie. Fondue, développé, balance, balance, soutenu, and baby développé. Good. Up, lean your head back. Yeah, show the audience your cheek. Promenade. Fondue. Nice. And Good. Let's see. Um, that was that was good overall. Um, I think that a lot of us could have used our head a little bit more and our balote to the front. Balote, when you do it as an adagio, it should be your body opposing your leg. So like if your leg is up here, that means your body has to like complete the V. Same thing front and back. So that means, yeah, exactly. Your head and shoulders have to lean slightly back and open. It's not like a hinge though. It's, it is slightly like a comb, right? It's more like, I think of it as an opening and widening of my chest, but that means you have to show this, uh, this side of your face to the audience. Uh, I had a professor when I was in school um, who would always tell us to show this part of our neck. He was like, that's where the money's at. It's right here in your neck. And I was like, what? But like, I, I get what he means. There is a lot of life right here um, because like 
our throat is here. Like we, we have, we need this area of our body to live. And I think it's a little bit more important than we give it credit for. So do show it off. Do like open your chest. How open can I be? And then same, you keep it when you go to the back, but it's more of a hooded gaze. So it's more under your elbow, but that should be again, opposition. So like, I'm not just going to be like in arabesque. I'm going to be in arabesque. And I'm sure like you can uh, find that a little bit better than me because I don't have a great arabesque, but find that like opposition. Okay. Um, I think there's a lot more like counterbalancing that we can do in ballet that we're not always encouraged to do. So I'm encouraging you to find some counterbalancing here. Um, I'd like to do it one more time. Okay. Perform it this time a little bit more expressive, a little bit more. Tell me about who you are as a human. Like I did learn things about you. Thank you for that. All right, let's do a little little jump. So we're gonna go change ma, change ma, see some simple ensemble. Change ma, change ma, see some simple ensemble. A chape, a chape, a chape. Bot two. You can bot two both on the way out and on the way in, or you can just go out, bot two, in, su, su. So, change ma, change ma, si, so, assemble. Change ma, change ma, si, so, assemble. A chape, a chape, a chape, bot two, su, su. Then we go again, okay? Two change ma, si, so, your opposite arm comes up to a uh, small pose. Assemble, change ma, change ma, opposite arm to small pose. Open with your arm and your leg coordinated. HP bot two, close fifth, su su. Okay? It's a party in the USA. Here you go, have a party with your petite jumps. Five, six, seven, eight. Sean Trump. HP, 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 bot two, su su. Change, change, up. Change, change. Okay, I think that in my brain, this was a little bit slower, so maybe let's do a slightly gentler tempo now so that I can give you some plie in there. I planned this last night, and I tend to get really excited about ballet when I'm planning, so then I think everybody can move super fast, but you might want a plie. Does this sound better? It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Bot two, su, su. Is that good? Awesome. Okay, here you go. Try this again. Your Achilles will thank you. Five, six, seven, and change, change, see so. Change, change, see so. It's okay. Su, su, and change, see so. Change. Okay, good. We're just going to do one more jump and then we'll go to like a more contemporary ballet combination that's a little longer. I don't love jumping at home. It's been hurting my feet a lot, so I don't love making people jump a ton at home either. Um, I've been encouraging my students to like do other types of cardio so that they don't kill their 
ankles. Um, so we're gonna do three balote jump with um, two bent legs. So we go balote, 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 cabriole. Balote, 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 cabriole. Then we're gonna do a pas faille, so hop, saute fouette, saute fouette, pas de bourre, entre So that's what it looks like. Balote, 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 cabriole. Balote, 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 cabriole. Pas faille, saute fouette, pas faille, saute fouette, pas de bourre, entre Balote, 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 cabrillo. Balote, 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 cabrillo. Pafai, saute fuerte. Pafai, saute fuerte. Pas de bourre de susu, plié, entre cap. After you do that second saute fuerte, let's go five and a six, seven and eight. Okay, so there's a little like accent the susu in your pas de um, we can mark this one first so I don't make you go super fast. Is that okay? Yeah? Okay, here you go. Um, a couple of us were facing the wrong direction, so this would be an eight passe. We start in quasi, but then as you balotate, it opens to eight passe. Um, it was pretty good. I think that most of us have like a really stiff plie, which again, I understand because the floors are not your friends right now. But as much as we can try to deepen your plie every time it gets deeper before you go up. And then after you do your second uh, cabriole, this little papaye needs to be more of like a gather of your um, strength. So as you go from cabriole, hop, but go down and coordinate everything coming up together. Hop, everything goes down and coordinates go up together. I feel like we weren't really going down with our energy. We were just trying to like keep jumping, but take that moment in your plie to make your plie sink deeper as your arms come down before the fuete. Okay, let's do it one more time. Here you go. Seven and balote. Cabrillo, balote. Cabrillo, chafari, sote fuerte. Fai, sote fuerte. Cabre, and entre cap. Balote, two, three, cabrillo. One, two, three, cabrillo. Cafai, fuerte. Fai, fuerte. Cabre de susu. Fille. Good. If you want to take a second to get a drink of water or something, you can go do that for like a minute. So this is like a more contemporary ballet combination. Um, 
most ballet companies have like a very mixed rep of classical ballet and contemporary ballet right now and are even incorporating more and more like modern and jazz. So, you know, we had to do contemporary ballet. And actually that's, I feel like is uh, a stronger area for me because I've, uh, I am very much a contemporary ballet dancer at heart. Um, so let's do it. Um, this song is Santa Clara by The National, if you happen to want to revisit it. Um, so we're going to start in uh, like a tom do front in quasi. I'm going to teach you facing away, but then I'll turn and face you sometimes because I don't want to do the opposite leg the whole time because my brain will explode. So <laughs> you just start with your arms down in tom do quasi. There's a uh, eight counts uh, to wait at the beginning and you can Wait one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then you're gonna go one and two, three, four. So we just did five, six, seven, eight. Pique, close fifth, rond de jam, pas de bourre de plie, développe to uh, epasse fourth position on relevé. Um, don't hold me to these counts. I'll confirm them with the music. So one, two, three, four, five, six. I guess it depends on if I want to count fast or slow. Huh? Let's figure that out. I want to count double time, so that means you actually have two eights as an intro, so your second eight is your arms. So we wait one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then we go one, two, three, four, five. Your hips go forward here, six. Then you're going to take your hips back and like poke your, your um, toe through a hole. So you're going to poke. And when you do that, you kind of stick your right hip out a little bit. So it's a very like twisted, contorted line. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. On eight, it's like a little flick. That's the end of it. Then we are going to chasse into a drag turn, plie, arabesque, your arms come up to fifth. So just that, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Then from there, you can, you can make a choice based on how much space you have. If you want, you can fight or you can step from arabesque back. But we're all gonna find tandu in third arabesque. So I will probably have to step back because I have a very, very small apartment. So from here, I'm going to step back and tendu, fuete, and plie. But if you want, you can fai and fuete because that might feel actually like nicer. Um, so we wait. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, let's try that much with music together. When when you're standing at the beginning, I want you to think of it like like you're taking account of how your body is at that moment. So it's kind of like a body scan. When you're there, you'll be like, "How am I feeling? What am I into today? What does my body need today?" And that's, that's where we're at. Okay, here you go. And this is kind of like looking at the world around you, inviting it in. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Do you have any questions about that part so far? No? Okay. Do you want to mark that again? 
Yeah, okay, let's mark it again. See the world? Good. Then this part might get confusing because I'm going to be facing you, but it's my back, right? Um, so just be aware of that. I, I trip people up with that sometimes. So we just did Tandu Fuerte. Then we're going to go Chasse. So we just, we're here, we go Chasse. This is my left leg. Turn in, turn out to fourth, uh, second position on route bay. So if I were to do that facing my back, I would go Chasse, turn in, turn out, second. Then we're going to flick our fingers. Flick, melt it down. So we go wrist, wrist, right arm opens. And this left arm, it kind of just disappears as soon as it can. So we just did fuete. Then we go chasse, turn in, turn out, flick, flick. Watch your right arm as it comes down. Okay? So let's go back over the from the beginning. So we go pique one, round two, pas de bray three, four. Try to make that round to jam like the floor is falling out from under you, so it's like suddenly out of nowhere. Five, six, seven, click, eight. Your arms pass through first there, and then end up in that uh, long inner Drag turn one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, chasse. Why don't we take the chasse on eight? Then we go one, two, flick, three, four, watch your right arm, six. Then we're gonna pull it to fifth, seven, eight. So your right foot comes into front fifth. Yeah. If you would like, you could you could plie and bring it in, or you could just slide together. You could tondu. Um, so whatever feels good there. It might be kind of nice to do it as like a reverberation to get into fifth, but I'll let you make that choice. So after we just did that, um, oh yeah. So we just pulled to fifth and now I'm going to be facing, I'm facing my back again. Then I'm going to saute arabesque left foot in third arabesque. So I just did five, six, seven, eight, one chasse right, Ballone, ballone. Then you're going to assemble to fifth position with your uh, arms coming up to fifth. So you might have to take this chasse, like real sharp diagonal, and then this kind of under yourself assemble. <laughs> We're all going to be really good at dancing super tiny when this is over. Let's mark all of that together. We go chasse eight. This is one, two, flick, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, and one, two, three, and four, and five, ensemble six. Do you want to do that much again? Yeah? Okay. Here we go. I'm going to face you this time as my friend. Don't be confused though, because it looks like I'm on the other leg. Pique, rush, pause, rip, double kick, thread it through. Drag turn, pique, relevant, pause, 
Twenty. Chance. Turn in. Out. Flip. Flip. Watch your arm come down. Two. Two. Six. So take. Chance. And balance. Balance. A sauté. So after you go sauté, Airbus. So you go. And one. Chance. Two. There's a moment for you to step on and. That way you can go three. Otherwise, like, you can't balance. But it's a moment that kind of feels like it shouldn't be there, but it should be there, okay? Um, do you want to go back or keep going? Keep going, okay. So we just did the saute, chasse, balance, balance. Then we're going to, we also made a fifth, five. Six, and then we're going to do a devil pay to ponche seven, eight. Your arms go through first. They lead by your elbows to come back to like a elange. And it's a devil pay. Bum, ba, da. Yeah, that's my right leg. So I just did ballone, ballone, ensemble, six, seven, eight. Okay. Um, I would be facing my downstage left corner when I do that ponche. So this is my downstage left corner. Then I'm gonna go one, two. So your feet come to parallel after your ponche. That should feel really like out of nowhere. So you go parallel and down. And like put your arms down like that's enough, like I'm done. Um, I want the impetus for coming out of this to be a contraction and your bottom leg turning in. So contract in your lower abdominals and turn your leg in, and that's what collects everything. So we just did seven, eight. We go one, two, stand here, three, four. Then you're going to take your right arm and your right leg forward. Run a jam and open your chest. So we go one, two, three, four. Five, six, PK seven, eight. So that's a like lead with your arm, but definitely okay, front. It turns out as you carry side, PK turn with our uh, left arm and left leg up. Then we're gonna tombe, jump to tendu back. So it's like a little tombe, coupe, tendu. Yeah. So we just did. Turn in, turn out, flick, flick, arm comes down, pull a fifth, seven, eight, saute, one, chasse, and ballonne, ballonne, assemble, développe, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one. This is second arabesque. I think I did it wrong before it's second arabesque. Do you wanna keep going? No, let's let's go mark all of that together. Arms. And keep it. Drops. Hallelujah. Double kick. Spread it through. Drag turn. See it. Up. Hold it. Fuente, chasse, turn in, turn up, wrist. Now, pull it in. So take chasse and ballon, ballon, ensemble, double head. Plie, up, hold. Double head, pique. Um, I think I would actually take, like to take a little bit more time after we stand up. So we just did. One, two, hold three, four. Let's go five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three. Okay, so make this two counts. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three. I think that'll feel a little bit better. Um, cool. We just have a little bit more, so I'm just gonna finish it off and then we'll do it a few times. So after that, we go balance to the left, and we're going to um, turn our bottom arm palm out. So we go left, 
Balance at your right, same thing. Then you're going to go chasse entrenant to the side, one to the back, on the down pirouette, land in fifth, slide to fourth. So I just did uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three. We can hold four, then let's go five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, whoo, five, fourth position, six. Sorry, my apartment is very small. Does that make sense? Yeah, okay, let's mark it one last time and then we'll just give it a go a few times. That last moment of finding your V is like, you took, it's the end of the day, you took a survey of like everything you did that day and you're like, I don't know if I'm proud of this, but this is where I am today, okay? So it's just like a moment of like honesty. It's like, I'm here. Is that enough? Here you go, Mark. balance again? Sure. So we just did three, hold four, then we go balance to the left, palm is out, six, seven, eight, chasse side one, chasse back two, tombe three, on your down pirouette four, five, six, seven, eight. So it closes fifth and then you slide your foot back to fourth. So it's not like a real step. Um, if you need to change which way you're doing the chasse entrenats, you could. Like you could go down, say five, six, seven, eight. You could go two this way. You could go chasse and then chasse entrenat. You could do one chasse entrenat. So don't feel like you have to really stick to that part. But ideally, we would go side, back, prepare to quasi, on the down pirouette, fifth B. Anything else? Cool. Okay, let's give it a try a couple times. Here you go. How are you? Invite the world in. Good. At. Dead okay. Drag it. Drag turn. See ya. And up. Chasse. Turn in. Turn out. Wrist. Wrist. Melt. Pull the fifth. Saute. Chasse. Ballone. Ballone. Ensemble. Développe. Plie. And up. Wait. Développe. Front. Carry side. Pique. Tombe. Coupe de tendu. Balance. Balance. Chasse. Chasse. Find your front. Inside. Good. Okay, good. So most of us didn't actually take your time to stand there for two counts. So after we go double pay to Itanche, seven, eight, you go one, stand up abruptly, two, wait, three, four. So try not to let your movement bleed into that moment of stillness. So that way when you double pay forward, so you just did forward, stand up, then this is really coming from like, inside your body, this decision to go like this, okay? So make it come for a little bit more internally. Um, this, this round shot at the beginning was really nice. I think we can take our plie a little bit deeper. 
the moments where our hips are out, so that uh, fourth position and then that little thread through, I think we can take our hips out a little bit more. And then our turn in, turn out can be a little bit gooier. Try to make this just your wrist, wrist metal, okay? Good. Let's, I think we have time to do it one more time, okay? Here we go. Good. And peek up. Three. Bada boom. Up. Good. Look. Test. Drive shirt. Three. Yes. Air back. What say? Chasse. Turn in. Turn out. Wrist. Wrist. Now. Pull it in. So say. Chasse. Ballonet. Ballonet. Ensemble. Développe. Come. Stand up. Wait. Développe. Carry side. Tombe, coupe, balance, balance, chasse, chasse, inside pirouette, find your foot. Good. All right, we are out of time. This was so fun. I hope you guys had a great time. Thanks so much. It was a great class. Yeah, you're welcome. Thank you, guys.